Alrighty guys, welcome back to some more Magic World on the Magic World single player world. I was going to say on the Minecraft server, it doesn't really work. Anyway, a um, couple of changes. I've changed this guy out for a black sapling. Instead of a green sapling, the black sapling makes ink sacks and black tree dye, whereas the green sapling makes cactus green and green tree dye. Black tree dye and ink sacks you can use for ink in Mistcraft. Whereas the green stuff, I don't really have a use for, so this is much more useful. If we even check the uses of green, we can make green stained clay and green stained redstone lamp. Green glass, green redstone blocks, green blocks, green wool, green spell books. Oh, you could cut your spell book, that's exciting. Runes and stuff. So we can get the other dyes if we need it, but really the most useful one is going to be the black dye, simply because you can get ink sacks with it, and uh, or ink with it for Mistcraft, and I'll probably be using a lot of that, especially as my whole base is set up with interlinking books, so yeah, it's extremely useful for me. Um, one other change we're going to make, this guy here we're going to get rid of, he's a, he's a gatherer golem. Uh, we could reuse him somewhere else, but really, for this purpose, he's not great. He keeps going over, collecting this stuff, which I don't particularly want. Even though I'm going to move this, it's still something I want to avoid. Uh, he also gets the most damage when a Fusewood log appears. Uh, he went down to, like, one health. I actually watched them one time. He went down to one. The mining, or the, the chop guy, he kind of does okay. This guy's just over here, so he doesn't even get affected. Uh, but this guy, he kind of jumps around the tree, so he gets affected a lot. So we're going to remove him. We're going to replace him with item item collector from random things. We need some ender pearls, a hopper, obsidian stick, and redstone. Let's grab some of that. Okay, I've just grabbed the obsidian from the cave. I have the redstone. I need the ender pearls. One, two, three. So, item sucker in my bobber. Should have enough. Accent. We need a stick too. I forgot about that, but we got it. So this guy here, he sucks items from within a two block radius. You can upgrade it to the advanced one, which sucks for a ten block radius. That's what we probably want to do, actually. I'm trying to fly because I think I'm still in bat form, but I'm not. Um, let's grab some glowstone as well, which is up here. It's not too expensive, so we might as well. Whoops. Come back. There we go, thank you. Let's do that. That, there we go. That, and that. So this sucks within a 10 block radius, uh, which is probably better for us. Um, let's be a bat again, because being bats nice and useful, we can fly every fly over stuff and such. This guy's freaking out trying to grab something. I'm not sure what he's trying to grab, to be honest. So if we put this down, it should suck items towards it, but we have to put an inventory below it, I believe. So let's grab some wood from here. We're going to grab some Rowan wood and make a chest real quick. Like so. Okay. Uh, we could put it on top of that, really, to be honest. We might try that. Okay, good. It just breaks. I'm scared I might lose it for a second. Okay, so if you put that on top of there, any items in the area should get sucked towards it. Um, let's try it here quickly. Let's track down one of these. I think. Aha, yes, excellent. Instantly. Okay. Good. So if we grab this guy, the gatherer guy, uh, we do need our bell, wherever that's gone, to break him with. Should be in one of these chests somewhere. One would have thought. Is it over here? Yes, gone bell. If we use this guy, to break the gatherer. Pow! So he should have got sucked into there, actually. He did. It's pretty much instant. Uh, where did his core go? 
Should have come with the core. Ah, I still got the gatherer core, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We broke him. I remember. Okay, so that thing should grow now. If we've got some more bones, we could try it. We have a couple more. Let's give it a whirl, see what happens. And if it's Fusewood, even better, we can test if the other guy's going to get beat up. But I don't think he should. He should be fine. Why are you left-clicking now? Oh, no. I swear it said left-click. Interesting. So what we got? Darkwood? So all this stuff should be getting sucked into here, I think. I don't see it yet. Oh, there's, there's some. Darkwood. Hey now, why, why, why you grow grass too? You shouldn't have done that for sure. Okay, so it's not getting everything. It's not getting that over there. But it got a lot of the stuff. So what is your radius? Let me uh, look this up and, and see. Okay, so it is a 10 block radius. It's not diameter. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It shouldn't have any problem picking that up. Aha! Right clicking on it. That helps. Uh, so radius X. Right, I assume X is... well, this, uh, this is Z. Okay, so if we increase the radius Z up to maybe 10. Okay, maybe the radius X. Maybe the radius Y. That's Fusewood. Here we go. Boom. Okay, he did get a little damage. Let's turn that off so we can see him. See, he doesn't take too much damage, so he's okay. Now that should pick up that piece of fuse wood right there. Do we have any fuse wood in here? No. Hmm. I fail to understand. We're getting the sorting wood in. Okay. Let's try relogging. Let's see what happens then. It may be glitchy. No. Okay. It's still this piece right here. Now we can't test it because we've got a bone meal. It should be okay. See if we've got any more bones. I want to test this more. I want to see what's going on. Aha! I found some bones. Alrighty. We're going to test this manually so we can kind of gauge what's going on ourselves. So, some loftwood. We should see loftwood appearing in here. With any luck. It seems to be. There is some of this stuff that's still not getting sucked in, though. Okay, now it is sucking some stuff in. Maybe. Yeah, it's sucked in an apple, I think. But there's this here. Whether it's because it's on a different level to it? That may be it. Let's try a chest. It takes forever to break. We're in bat mode. Let's try a chest down on the ground here. Let's break you. Okay, you didn't suck yourself up. That would have been really bad. And let's pop that there. And do a radius of 10. Okay, yeah, it seems like it's it can't suck any lower than what it is. Okay, that seems to be it. Alright. I can live with that. 
So let's test this again. Canopy tree. We should see stuff appearing in there. Anything we get right now will be from in there. Let's see what happens. Once this guy decides that he's going to mine the tree. There you go. Go for it, little guy. So we should see... Yes, we're getting stuff in here. Excellent. Okay. It seems to be working fine now, then. There's nothing going around to the wrong side, no. And it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It should be able to pick it all up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It may pick up stuff from over here, which I'd rather it didn't. So if we... This is the x-axis. If we decrease the x-axis to maybe six, it should be better. Whoops. This is hellbark. So many different kinds of trees. <laughs> it's crazy. Okay, yeah, it's picking up some hellbark. It seemed to pick everything up there. Let's drop this piece of dirt on the ground here. Okay, that's not getting sucked up. Nothing else is going, coming in. Okay, so let's increase X. Okay, yeah, now it got sucked up. Okay. Excellent. But say over here, this should still be close enough. Yes. Okay, cool. Fantastic. I understand how this works now. Excellent. And that should mean... See, it says left click now, but it's it's not. It's really right click. This should mean that our golems won't be killed by the fusewood. Because he's fine. He He's safe from it. He's safe from it. The only one who wasn't was that gatherer one. But he won't be over here anymore. Let's move these chests over so everything is going into there now. And I'm going to upgrade them and such. Oh, everything went into there anyway. I'm going to upgrade them and such and connect them to the sorting system or whatever. Um, you, if we take our bell, you, I now want to not get it from there. Oh, you know what? I'm going to have to break you completely, eh? Okay, that's fine. Did you get sucked away? Whoops. You did. Okay, coming up. You, wait here. Wait, wait. Here? No, come on now. There we go. Wait there. Uh, no, 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 no. Want one of these. Take this. Uh, use this. Yes. Nothing else ever. Put that in there. And. Break that. So now you should use that one there. Excellent. You're going to get everything from this chest, which is where everything is going into. Excellent. This chest we'll need to sort. Now we won't be getting our essences into this section either, which is good. We just need to sort everything else out of this section. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's working now. Can we scan the random or the, the item grabby bobber at all? Anything? Nothing? Clay golem's in the way at the moment. Move out of the way. And and you too. Wait. Oh wow, lots of stuff. Nice. Okay. Anyway, let's um, work on something else now that that's fixed. Alrighty, guys, just over here at one of my pretty crafting benches, the uh, I think it's biomes of plenty or Natura. Sorry, you can see in the top there on uh, why whatever it's called. Natura adds these crafting benches of different colors depending on what kind of wood you make them out of. It's a nice little touch. Anyway, um, what we're going to make. Something I don't have the stuff for. Hang on, let me go to my stones. Let's grab one, two, three, four pieces of stone. I think this is going to do something. This item. If it does what I think it's going to do, then we need it. If it doesn't, then we may use it later on. Um, I, we want that, 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 and that. Sigil of Gentle Rains. Now, I think if we right-click this...
I've no idea. I haven't looked this up or anything. I think if we right click this, it will cause the world to make rain. Hopefully. Let's see. No. No, it doesn't. <laughs> um, sigils then. What are sigils? Items. No, I know there is some kind of sigil stand or something. Thinking about it that I've seen. Crystal pillar? No, that's not it. It may not be something we have yet. Magic sigils, okay. Um, sigils of gentle rain. Sigil gentle rain causes a small localized rainfall for four blocks in all directions, which causes soil to be hydrated without the need for nearby water. The radius can be expanded. Ah. Well, fuck. We don't need this. <laughs> ah, damn it. I was, I was hoping that would do something else. Okay. Um, fair enough. Never mind, ignore this segment. So, this thing doesn't seem to be collecting anything anymore, and it keeps growing grass for some reason, which I'm not too sure about. When we rebuild it, we can just um, knock, all this, like, knock all the grass away, so then it won't. But this thing is, is not picking stuff up. I assume it's because the inventory below it, which is technically this chest, is now full. If we move this... Yeah, it's picking stuff up. Okay. That's what I thought. So in that case, we're going to have to break... To pick up this guy. Again. Um, I need a regular hopper. Whoops. If I have one. Or if I can make one. I have one. Okay, excellent. Put that one back in there, and let's break. Oh, you know what? Let's grab a grab an axe while I'm up here. Whoops! That was not fusewood. That was a meteor. Where'd it land? Where did it land? Somewhere nearby, because I heard it quite loud. Hmm. I don't see it though. It sounded like a meteor to me. Unless it was a creeper blowing up one of these guys. Yeah, there's no hole in the tree. It could have been one of that. Okay, fair enough. Uh, let's grab an axe. Um, from here. Thank you. Put that on my bar. Oh, I just barely got any uses left. Two. Okay. Uh, I should have an axe of a stream. Oh, I got a thorn. I can use this. That'll do. And let's become human. Okay, so. Let's break this guy. That's going to spill out a whole bunch of crap. That's fine. Let's break this guy as well. Under here. Let's go with that pointing that way. Uh, we're going to want to grab that dirt. Hopefully. I need that chest too, actually. Um, Where is the dirt? Did I pick any dirt up? I should have done, because I dug down to you. Interesting, unless this guy picked it up. Mm, yes, he did. Okay, fantastic. Right, let's get up here. Let's break this block, this block, and this block. Okay, and now I want a couple of chest blocks. Wherever they are. There's one. Let's grab the other one. Excellent. We'll put these here. Now this hopper will drain into this chest down here, which will drain out this chest, which will allow this sucking my bobby to suck the rest of it up. This guy will now put down here, and we'll tell him, no, no, behave. Uh, we need to get some black dye from somewhere, or a black tree sapling from somewhere. You're trying to use that on there, aren't you? And you just you just can't do that, can you? You dummy. Okay, so this guy's now using black tree saplings. This guy's still gonna knock him down. This thing's gonna suck them up. Still got the same radius, which is interesting. This thing's gonna suck them up. 
absolutely fine. Pop them into this chest. Oh, you know what? We didn't break that, so yeah. Um, pop them into this chest, and then that will get sucked down into that chest. With any luck. They don't seem to be sucking out right now. Interesting. No, it's it's draining properly. I think it's just draining from up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's working how we want it to. So I'm just making some more seeds here. Um, no, I'm not. Hang on. I need to grab some... One, two, three, four of those. So I had them in my inventory and I literally just put them away. Boop, 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 boop. And this guy and four water buckets will make us some water seeds. Excellent. Those will come into play later on, probably next episode, as this episode is getting towards the end. Let's just plant those. One there, one there. Sure, why not? Go crazy. Excellent. We should get some water essences from that, and that will do what I was hoping the other useless item, this thing, will do eventually. And now, just to finish off, let's see if we can make a quick spell. Uh, we want to go to As Magica, and we want a blank book. Excellent. Put that in there. We want a projectile that we could do light and dig. That's, well, we don't want that. We could do light and dig. Eh, no, it's not necessary. We could do dig. I want to learn also about the colours. The colour I am unsure about. Um, do, do, do. Talents. Colour. This modifier allows you to change the colour of particles on your spell. Want green fireballs? Have it. Colour is determined by the colour of dye you throw in during the crafting process. Okay. Uh, that's not necessary. We don't need that. Uh, this is just going to be projectile dig. That's that's not where that goes. Hang on. Projectile dig. So it's projectile. It digs. Congratulations. Make that. Okay. Let's pop that in here. Uh, in fact, we should read it. Blank rune, vintium dust, arrow, snowball, orange rune, iron shovel, iron pickaxe, and spell parchment. We should be able to handle that. Let's go to the farm. Let's grab some orange dye. Let's grab a snowball, which I should have somewhere. I may have used my last one, actually. Making another spell. That's highly likely. If needs be, I can just run and get one. Uh, we need some paper. And a couple of sticks. Do we have any kind of wood? Not really. We can use Sakura wood. That's fine. Bum, bum, bum. Oh. Pretty sticks. Not the kind of sticks I was hoping for. Okay, that worked fine anyway. Excellent. Pop that away. Uh, we want, we've got the orange dye, we've got the spell parchment, we want the arrow, which I have plenty of. We want iron pickaxe and an iron shovel. So, four bits of iron. One, two, three, four. And four sticks. One, two, uh, we'll use these. Like so. Okay. And just the snowball. Uh, Vintium dust as well, actually, sorry. Vintium dust. And then a snowball, which I will go grab right now. And let's go back into human form. My boots should save me. They did. Still don't know what that is. Uh, let's go over here. Let's go to as uh, Magica. Excellent. So, in this chest, let's drop a couple of things that we don't exactly need. Let's go over here. Let's make two blank runes. This is from the Magician's Workbench. 
Uh, one of those blank runes we need to make into a orange rune, like so. Okay, and then come over here. We'll chuck in this guy. Okay, Vintim Dust, boom, arrow, boom, snowball, boom, orange rune, boom, iron shovel. I don't know if it'll take a damage one. It doesn't. Okay, that's fine. That's why I got extra to make another one. I'd rather not use this workbench. Do I have any wood? No. Okay, fair enough. We'll use this. Let's clear out that. Let's go like so. And like so. Make one of those and one of those. Chuck a new. Chuck a new. Wait. Chuck a new. Okay. And the spell parchment. Excellent. Now we've got a projectile spell, which projectile dig, and we want... How do we want to do, indicate it's a projectile dig? To be honest, I don't really look at the, the picture, but hey-ho. Let's just do kind of a green fireball. Why not? And exit that. So, the reason why I made that is because in bat form... Uh, in fact, let's open up this guy. In bat form, you can't really aim your projector, or you can't aim your dig. It kind of digs one block one block above where your head is. So if I'm here, it will dig this one. Because it thinks I'm too high still, but I'm really on one high because I'm a bat. It's that's at centers, I never thought I'd say. Anyway, this should now, if it works, allow us to just shoot and dig it. Excellent. And the way, because uh, projectiles, they kind of emerge from actually where you are, that will dig in the right direction. It also has a benefit of allowing us to dig from further away. Say if there's a spawner or whatever, we can just go pow and shoot it, and that'll take care of it. But, you know, that's that's just a useful little spell. Um, it's a little slower than digging properly, or digging without it, but it works. So, pow pow, make two holes. Nice. Now, if only there was a spell that allowed me to pick up those items from afar. There probably is, actually. I'll have to look into that. Um, let me break in here, too. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. This thing's going to get dangerous pretty quickly, actually. I shouldn't be firing it willy-nilly. But you see, now I can I can shoot actually where my head is, which is nice. Uh, anyway, I think that's it for another episode of Magic World on the not Minecraft server. Um, as always, thank you guys very much for watching. Next episode, those water seeds down here, they will come into play, uh, which will be quite fun, hopefully. And yeah, I shall see you all next time.